Hey everyone, it's Megan, and in case you're wondering about my lovely puff sleeve number I have, it is because I am reviewing the names of the Von Trapp children um, that were portrayed in the Sound of Music, and many of you probably already know, but they, this was based off of a true story, the musical it um, was a movie as well as it's a play, and but what you might not know, because I didn't know it, maybe you do, is that the children um, were renamed for this script. So I didn't know that, I just assumed that those were their actual names, so I'm going to tell you what um, their real names were and then what their names are for the musical and you can kind of decide which ones you like better. And you know, um, their governess, Maria, I, don't worry I won't break into song, she made their clothes and they had like some puff sleeves and stuff and so that's why I'm wearing this shirt and um, yeah, I'm just being fun today, <laughs> I don't know. Um, the other kind of funny thing is that they changed the birth order and like genders of the children. So so, um, not the genders, they're the same amount of like girls and boys, but um, they did like, there. well there is no Liesl, but she's not the oldest. What? What's going on? Yeah, so let's get started. The first child was Rupert. Rupert is a German name, it's a variation of the name Robert, and it means bright fame. I know a couple people like this name on here. Um, and he was portrayed by Friedrich. Friedrich is also a German name, it's a variation of Frederick, and it means peaceful ruler. The second child was a, a girl and her name was Agatha. Agatha is a variation of the name Agatha. It means good and it also means honorable. And she was portrayed by the character Liesel. Liesel is a German name. It's a diminutive of the name Elizabeth and it means God's promise. Then the next child, another daughter, is Maria. Yes, there was a Maria as well. That was a child of Captain Von Trapp. Maria is a Latin name. It's a variation of the name Mary. It means bitter. Um, it's still popular here in the United States. It's number 101. And um, like I said, there was no Liesl. I don't know why that's so upsetting to me. But Maria, this this little girl, actually had a really beloved doll that she took with her. And um, that doll's name was Liesl. So that's kind of interesting. And um, the character of Maria was portrayed by Louisa. Louisa is a German name, and it's a variation of the name Louise, and it means famous warrior. The next child was Werner. Werner is German, um, it means guard or defender, and he was portrayed by the, the name Kurt. Kurt is German and it means courteous, it also means polite. Then there was Hedwig. <laughs> Harry Potter people will love it. I just think it's a fun name, honestly. Um, Hedwig is German. It means war and strife. A lot of um, famous people with this name have gone by the nickname Hedy. Um, and Hedwig was portrayed by Br Brigitta. Excuse me. Um, Brigitta is actually really fun to say, I think. But yeah, Br Brigitta is a variant of the name Bridget, and it means exalted one. Next up is Johanna. Johanna is Hebrew and it means God is gracious. It's number 482 in popularity and she was portrayed by Marta who when I was growing up and watching this movie with my parents I loved Marta because she had like long dark braid and I always had my hair in long dark braids. Um, Marta is a Hebrew and Roman name. It's also an Aramaic name and it means lady. And then the last of the children is Martina. Martina is Latin. It means warlike. It can also mean um, dedicated to Mars. And she was portrayed by Gretel. And Gretel is a variant of the name of Margaret. That means pearl. So those were the children in the musical and play. But actually, Maria and Captain Von Trapp did go on to get married and have three children together. Actually, um, she was pregnant a fourth time but um, miscarried that last one, but three children that um, survived that they had together. The first was Rosemary. It's a variant of the name Rosemary with an E in there at the end of Rose before Marie. It's a French combination of the names Rose and Marie, and it means Dew of the Sea. It's kind of cool. And then the next daughter they had together was Eleonore. And Eleonor is German. It's a form of the name Eleanor. It means sun ray or shining light. And then they had Johannes. Johannes is German and Dutch. It means God is gracious. So those are the Von Trapp children for you. I'd love to hear what your favorite name out of these are. And um, I hope that you are having a lovely day and wearing your puff sleeve shirts today. And I'll talk to you soon for the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.